I fell in love with a Scorpio. It's a crazy story though. She was super pretty, the baddest in my portfolio. She was super sweet, I would eat her up like a Oreo. I don't know how I got her, I'm giving God all the glory though. And she was born in October or November. I really cannot remember. I hope it doesn't offend her. She told me that she loved me because I was so sweet and tender. And I would always defend her. And I was not a pretender. <laughs> but one day she was acting so mysterious. I was curious, and honestly, I was furious. Wasn't talking to me, she really had me delirious. I was overthinking, I didn't know she was serious. I thought maybe she had found somebody else but honestly she told me she was working on herself she took some time off to focus on her mental health and i had to accept it regardless of how i felt huh. but all in all what i learned in the end is i love scorpios i swear scorpios are 10 but be careful because as soon as you get in she might turn hey, what's up it's kind of dark it is because you know i i'm gonna turn a little light on for my other phone thank god for multiple iphones okay so let's get into it scorpio i'm in my room but it's not dark but it just looks dark so let's get into it scorpio what's somebody's true emotions about you or the situation how does person feel let's just get into it okay i was actually doing one okay so it says block so somebody just feel like you know you block them you know they're thinking about how and this doesn't have to be blocked physically because it's not somebody just feel like in their mind you just don't want to fuck with them like that you could be focused on your computer you excuse me you could have an apple computer or an apple phone okay but it just says block spam and text calling somebody also could be calling you from rotary numbers this could be another female you could be like what's wrong with this bitch this bitch is thrilled okay so somebody could just be really thrilled and they could be calling you off rotary numbers or block phone numbers and you like this is crazy that this girl is doing that and you could be thinking like why is this girl doing all of this okay so this could be a female doing this dudes do this stuff too you know for attention all right so they're doing this because you're really good at whatever you're doing, okay? So they're doing this to you because you're very confident, okay? You're secure. You're a boss bitch. You focused on your career. And whoever this is, they're mad, okay? They're not happy. Look at this salty motherfucker, okay? So somebody is mad at you because you block them. You don't want to communicate with them on any social media platform, okay? And it's because you're secure in who you are. You know who you are. You're very confident. You're focused. You're not thrown off by penis or vagina you you're, you're conquering something you're moving past the 98 percent you know what i mean you go into that two percent and you can see it okay you see it because you don't spend your money on worldly items you know how to like harness that thing and make it grow and make it flow into something else okay you're not scared to take a risk or anything like that you're very confident and you're very strong and somebody hate that shit about you they're like oh you get on my motherfucking nerves okay but it's okay keep going okay keep doing that and this person they could be coming at you from every angle and you just block their dumb ass you block 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 you just be blocking their dumb ass okay and they get so upset because they want to penetrate you they want to bother you they want to get under your skin they want to make you not happy because they're not happy but you just thriving you just looking good you a queen bee you don't got no problems to be not you know and sometimes people are like oh why are you so happy but because you got a good life because you're breathing because birds are chirping because you know we got running clean water we got central air we got ac it's a great a lot of things to be grateful for and somebody just can't never see it they always seeing the negative in this okay damn okay feelings here in reverse so scorpio somebody feel like you be cutting your motherfucking feelings off somebody feel like you a savage classy bougie ratchet okay somebody feelings like somebody feels like you be having all these feelings you be loving light and then you be mean as fuck you be sharp as shit with your tongue you know what i'm saying all this over no flowers okay that's what somebody's saying you doing all this shit over no flowers or over no love or over no whatever this is but maybe this is a big deal to you you know what i'm saying and if it's not you gotta tell people leave them alone okay yeah okay so somebody is watching you or you watching somebody from your own account okay secret account here is in reverse so you were the queen and you watching somebody from your account that you said you don't have no feelings for okay that you told they thinking like oh you told me to block you dot 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 dot, dot. so this person could be thinking about, about blocking you because they're not happy that you looking at their account okay they're not happy that you liking they shit they like what the fuck you want my shit for okay so whoever this is they want to block you they've been thinking about blocking you okay because they're not happy with how things are with y'all and they feel like if you ain't got no feelings for them, why the fuck you on their page? Oh, this person is mean. Okay, this nigga vicious. This could be a dude. Yeah, because this person was thinking about popping a question with you. They want to get married to you. And you're going to say they thinking about blocking you now. Okay. 
okay but this is somebody who constantly left you hanging damn look okay it says no closure no contact left on red left you hanging so this is somebody who kept leaving you on hang on on red you tired of this you like bitch i'm not a bat i don't want to be sitting upside down like this so you like look i'm not gonna let no more red no more blood rush to my head fuck you okay so somebody just kept doing a number on you okay they kept leaving you hanging and you got tired of that shit this person also thinks about how they want to get married to you they want to pop the question to you but they're not happy with you right now this person going through a lot of emotions, okay? Uh, and they also thinking about blocking your ass, too. They really are. Somebody else is really sad about the separation between your person. So you, your person, you walked away from your person. Your person mad at you. Your person walked away from somebody else. Whoever that is, they suicidal. They mad about this separation. They want to reflect. They're like, baby, you don't miss me. We ain't talk. What's going on? Oh, it's a ring in their hand. So this could be a divorce that somebody could be walking away with. I ain't never seen a ring right here. So somebody's like, somebody, this could lead to separation. Somebody could be reflecting and soul searching. They just like, I don't know if this ring is the right decision, okay? So somebody is like, how the fuck you not going to propose to me, but you thinking about proposing to this girl, you know what I'm saying? All right, and somebody is just not happy. This could be somebody who has no blemishes on their face, all right? Their skin could be really beautiful. Like, this girl's skin is beautiful, you know? She got no blemishes, hair perfect, okay? But you just not happy, okay? Somebody thinking about popping a question to you. You could just be fed up, fed up with all the shit you got to do or your person is, okay? Somebody could be mad at you, though. Like, how you gonna be watching my account and doing all this shit? Somebody like, bitch, get off my page. They don't want to say that shit, but that's what they're saying in 5D. But they really do want you on their page, okay? They want to take action, okay, because they love you, but they've been showing you a lot of hate, and they don't want to leave you hanging no more. But they feel a lot of guilt. They feel embarrassed, and they feel like um they was in the wrong, okay? So somebody feels ashamed for how they acted towards you. They was guilty of doing these things to you, and they feel really embarrassed, and they feel bad because you was always nice. Whoever you are, you was kind. You know, you never really hit this person with any negativity, but you just felt like this shit was um not to like toxic for you so you had to just go back to you ain't nothing wrong with going back to you y'all that's good okay this girl could have had red hair okay that's a bob all right or to her shoulders or whatever but it's a lot here also a friend that moved away this could be in the mountains or she could be in florida okay this could be a caucasian woman she misses you okay so you know you could have a friend y'all could be cross um not not cross not Y'all could be different races or something like that, but she really does miss you, okay? She does, and she's gonna call you. So there's an old friend that moved away that's gonna call you out of the blue, and you're gonna be like, hey, what's up? But they don't live in your state. They live in another state, okay? Just so y'all know, they do not live in your state. I love you guys. Bye. Won't stop. Even when things get hard, I will never fold. I'm making my own title. I'm making my own way.